My name is Maria Alexander and my short story is Dangerous Deductions, starting about a third of the way through. Our pinto stops before a tall hedge next to a house that must be owned by Thurston Howell III. I imagine it has butlers and the furniture's like what's in the Jetsons, but I can't see inside. The windows are choked with thick drapes. Daddy's eyes flicker in the rearview mirror. You two, get down. His hairy hand swipes back at Benny's head. Get out of the seat belt and slide down behind the front seats. Now! I pop the seat belt and drop down behind the passenger seat. Benny does likewise. The cooling burrito bag sits at eye level. Daddy grabs something from the glove compartment and gets out of the car, shutting the door carefully. Benny's head pokes up. Get down, dummy! I pull her down below the window. Resigned, Benny fingers her Mary Janes, unbuckling the shoes. Soon, her shoes are off and she plays with her toes through her pink tights. Like a turtle, I crane my neck carefully to see out the window. A dog barks in the distance. Daddy digs for several minutes through a garbage can on the far side of Thurston Howell's house. He pulls out some papers and smiles. And then something bad happens. A man appears through the white wooden side gate and points a gun at Daddy's head. A cold feeling shoots down my throat and into my tummy. The man says something to Daddy I can't hear. Daddy drops the papers and puts his hands in the air. With his gun, the man prods Daddy through the gate and they disappear behind the house. Great. Now we'll never see Star Wars. <laughs>